absolutely ecstatic. We are here in the middle of Hollywood, the heart of it all, where it all began, next to TCL Chinese Theater, the most famous movie theater on the planet. It really is a, an indie filmmaker's dream. This is a complex movie. I've never done anything like this. And oddly enough, it's I'm sort of playing kind of almost like a version of like my worst self. Like, a, you know, it, it's this old washed up actor who kind of turns out to be a bit of a psychopath. When we wrote this film, we actually wrote the character of Eric for Jeremy and getting to be with him every day and acting with him in a leading role was really fun just watching his process. You know, I, I grew up watching him and then being next to him and in scenes with him, it was so fun. This project was a veritable cornucopia of genres. We had so much fun being able to sort of wield and balance these two worlds, this music video Fantasia that is our central character, Christina's inner monologue, and the real world. The process was crazy. Um, we shot 10 music videos in three days. The music videos are a perfect match of like a weird and crazy kind of escape from the movie, but they also add to the story line that you know all the characters are going through and, and the emotions that they're going through. It really pulls from so many of my loves of like the 80s music that I grew up with, a lot of the synthesizers and the drum sounds. We even found a nice 1984 electronic drum kit, like I got to play that. Mm -hmm. 